Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel again. In this video, I'll guide you through the process of joining a Windows 11 computer to an Active Directory domain using PowerShell, and I explained before how to join a computer to a domain in different ways, but this time it will be through the PowerShell window. Let's start. I have a domain running under the name ok.local, and the IP address is 10.0.0.150. This is the information I need to know before moving to the computer I want to join, in addition to knowing an account with admin privileges and its password. And from a computer running Windows 11, open the PowerShell window as an administrator. I will first check the domain response using the ping command to check if the domain is accessible from your computer. Type ping and then the name of the domain you want to join. This step ensures that there is a proper connection between your computer and the domain controller. If you do not receive responses, troubleshoot network or domain server connectivity issues before continuing. If you receive responses and there is proper communication between your computer and the domain controller, continue with the rest of the steps. Then enter the command hostname to specify the current name of the computer you will join to the domain Knowing this name helps you keep track of the machine you are working on, especially if you want to rename the computer. If you want to rename this computer before joining the domain, enter the command that appears in front of you on the screen. I will leave you in the video description all the commands used in the video so that you can easily access them and write the name of the new computer you want to name it. This step is not mandatory, but I strongly recommend it to facilitate management in your domain environment, it will show you what it will change the name to the new name after restarting the computer. I have one last step left, which is to join the computer to the domain. So enter the command that appears in front of you on the screen to join the computer to the domain, as this command adds the computer to the specified Active Directory domain, and the dash restart flag ensures that the changes are applied immediately by restarting the computer automatically. Once you execute the command, you will be asked to enter the credentials for the domain you want to join. Enter the username that has administrator privileges and the password and wait for a few seconds until the credentials are verified and then the computer will restart automatically. After restarting, Log in to the computer using the domain user account. Logging in using the domain account confirms that the computer has successfully joined the domain and that the domain controller is authenticating the user. It may take some time to log in with the new domain account since it will create a new profile for the user we logged in with. However, these steps have successfully joined the Windows 11 computer to the Active Directory domain using PowerShell. This command works with Windows 10, Windows 7, and Windows Server. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell for more tutorials. Feel free to leave a comment if you have any questions regarding this video or future videos. Thank you very much for watching, and see you in the next video.